Good day. Greetings to everyone. Let me start by providing the introduction to this study. Pandemic affected many people worldwide and academic institutions pursued new and innovative ways of teaching. Students of all levels can use YouTube as an alternate platform for sharing educational films with no restrictions. YouTube has grown to become the most popular video distribution platform globally. YouTube EDU was established in 2009 as a resource for lectures, courses, and examples in the educational field. YouTube launched several educational channels in 2012. A large number of students use YouTube to learn English. This research intends to fill a gap in the literature by focusing on students' real-life experiences with YouTube as an alternate language learning tool. Let's move on to the research question we will answer in this study. How do SHS students perceive YouTube's helpfulness in learning the English language in distance learning? For the methodology, the research design used in this study was phenomenological. This qualitative research method emphasizes the shared experiences of a group of people and a person living experiences in the world to allow students to share their experiences and let their voices be heard. Next, the instrument used was an online survey questionnaire that was distributed through email. Also, there are a total of 50 senior high school students from several schools in the division of Rizal. The participants were chosen purposely and conveniently. First, SHS students are expected to be independent learners considering their age. Second, most of them have access to the internet. And finally, this student can provide a rich source of data for this study, as much as the study needs an equal divided number of participants per grade level. It is impossible due to unstable internet connection. In analyzing the data, the survey responses were thematized based on the research and evaluation of the gathered data. Following Brown and Clark's 2006 Phases of Thematic Analysis, the data from this study were analyzed to determine how students perceived the use of YouTube as an alternative language learning tool and how YouTube can assist students in improving their language skills during this pandemic. The responses from the survey questionnaires were categorized and analyzed. Based on the responses and the survey results, questionnaires were analyzed using qualitative narrative analysis to see how students perceive YouTube as a learning tool and how YouTube can assist students in improving their language abilities. For the result, there are 85.19% of grade 11 students and 14.81% are grade 12. The study results revealed four major themes. First, enhancing speaking and vocabulary skills. And second, providing much information. Third, have students' academic performance. And lastly, improve self-confidence. First, let's talk about the first significant theme with 66% of the participants who said that YouTube helps students' academic performance. YouTube is an excellent source of knowledge. Watching the videos help to understand the lessons, such as writing and speaking. It assists students in understanding difficult to understand the lessons in online classes. One of the essential factors for students to improve their academic performance is YouTube tutorial content. Communication technologies have now broadened the scope of information and instant communication. Many students use YouTube as a source of information and communication. Students' academic performance and collaborative learning are improved due to the YouTube videos. Salium, Habes, al and Mamdi 2019. The second team has 54% of the participants mentioned that YouTube has a significant factor in enhancing their English speaking skills. YouTube videos can help students develop English speaking skills. 54% of the participants agreed that YouTube has an important factor in improving their English speaking skills. Third team revealed that YouTube has a significant help on students' comprehension of the English language and can help students broaden their perspectives on the subject and 22% of respondents believe that using YouTube's the supplement student education provides many benefits. And lastly, the study reveals that 8% of the participants believe that with the aid of YouTube, it would enhance the student's self-confidence. Participants enjoy learning English and watching YouTube videos has provided them with knowledge. Likewise, it has improved the student's self-confidence. The result of the study shows that YouTube has a significant 
influence in distance learning. It is a way that can develop and improve the English speaking skills of the students. Also, YouTube is an excellent source of information that helps students improve their academic performance. In addition, to this having an outstanding academic performance improves self-confidence for the students and gives motivation. Lastly, the conclusion. The study concludes that YouTube has been a great alternative and source of information that students can utilize despite not having the presence of the teachers. With all the tutorials and lessons available in YouTube, students can now learn everything they need to know. However, teachers still need to be available in teaching and learning process because not all students are born to be independent learners. Thus, it is a must that master teachers, department heads, and school administrator should develop a mechanism that embeds YouTube as an alternative tool to learn English as a second language in distance learning. Standard YouTube videos, lessons, or tutorials should be developed based on the context of the students. With the limitation of the current study, it is suggested to have a follow-up study that will delve more into a deeper understanding of students use, using YouTube as a language learning tools. If students hope to provide insight into students' personal experience on the use of YouTube in distance learning as an effective alternative language learning tools.